you knew Freddie Barnes was a semifinalist for the Boletnikoff Award given to the nation's top wideout. But yesterday, the BG senior was mentioned nationally as a dark horse Heisman candidate. Could it happen? Based on his stats, it's definitely possible. With 32 catches more than anybody in the country, with more receiving yards than anybody in the country, Bowling Green's Freddie Barnes is getting attention for the most hyped award in college football, the Heisman Trophy. Freddie Barnes, he's a wide receiver for Bowling Green. Yeah. Nine games, 107 catches, and 10 touchdowns. Does it say there with Barnes that he had like 273 yards in one game? Dan, he had 22 catches for 278 yards and three touchdowns against Kent State. The Heisman hype quickly made its way from the Dan Patrick show to Freddie's mom. Uh, she just uh, texted me and asked me if I heard the buzz about it. And I was like, Mom, that's not buzz. That's just somebody mentioning my name. So no big deal. It was funny to, to hear my name mentioned. Uh, on that radio show, but uh, I know that is unrealistic. Unrealistic because he comes from a non-BCS conference and also because the award typically goes to a quarterback and maybe a running back. But in a year where no one's really stood out... He would have to be at the top of the list of any of those guys just based on two things. Number one, his numbers, uh, it's just what he's doing uh, in terms of receptions and yardage and, and they're not meaningless catches. How many of his catches have changed the game? And, and where would we be without him? And no matter how unrealistic Barnes might think his Heisman chances are, he does admit this is pretty flattering. That would be like a, a dream come true, really. Anybody that plays uh, like one of those positions that you're able to win the Heisman, you will never turn that down, and that will be like the ultimate. As for just being in this Heisman conversation, that's pretty good, too.